getting everything off his chest. As Michael Brady takes the stand for a second time, he says he wants to tell the truth even if it hurts his case. Thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Adriana De Alba and for David Allen. And I'm Janet Roach. 13 News Now reporter Ali Weatherton is in Manteo tonight as we continue to learn more about the deadly attempted prison break. Michael Brady acted calm and casual as he described killing four people, and he says he had to do it to escape. Once Michael Brady took the stand, he held nothing back. And it hurt me a lot. It hurt me way more than you know to actually carry out that plan. Out that plan. He explained how he and three other inmates punched, stabbed, and hit the victims in the head with hammers, all to escape prison. I wet my hand off on my shirt because I cut my hand when I stabbed um, Mr. Smith. That's tragic, but you, you wipe the hammer off either way. I'm just trying to get the facts straight. Well, I appreciate that. After the attacks, all four inmates made it to the prison yard, but several law enforcement officers had their guns drawn. I was trying to get every officer that responded to shoot me. Officers arrested all four inmates. Brady is the first one on trial. He now faces life in prison or death. Yeah, God has pretty much uh, convinced me that I'm supposed to be incarcerated. I don't know. <laughs> If it was meant to happen, it would have happened on October 12th. Prosecutors say after the attacks in 2017, Brady attempted to hurt other correctional officers and set fire to his cell at Central Prison. And sir, you don't believe you're crazy, do you? No, I don't think I'm crazy, no. And you do know the difference between right and wrong? Yes. So you know murder is wrong? Murder is a different name for a death, but yes. And the sentencing phase could take a few more days. In Manio, Allie Weatherton, 13 News Now.